Let me ask you a question. What is it a job can tell can tell you they will give you for you to give up on your dream? Okay, let's have a conversation. Do you have a dream? What are you willing to do to get it? How passionate are you? Do you think about do you think about it all the time? Do the people around you know what you are doing? How long have you been thinking about your idea? Okay, now let's turn it around. How important is your idea to you? If someone was willing to offer you money for your idea, would you give it away? Okay. What can a company tell you for you to give up your dream? Or what can they give you for you to give up your dream? That what? You will get a promotion? That will make you give up your dream? Or what if they gave you a car? Or what if they gave you a race? Well, I guess the race is the same as promotion. But what if they were willing to relocate you somewhere else? What if they gave you $100,000 to start off with? What is it that someone can do or say for you to give up give up on your dream everything that i'm saying now is for myself as well as anybody else who needs to hear it because there's lots of times where situations can make you give up on your dream you could call it whatever you want time you didn't want it. there's not enough time security the you do not want to leave the security that you have at the moment. So, what is it? Or should I say, what excuse are you giving yourself? Because I give myself a lot. <laughs> Time. Security. But, I'm still trying. And this is the whole point. What I wanted to do was to show the journey of trying to get something. And right now, where I'm at with my company is, yes, I've made my company legal. It's LLC. Um, I am still, tr I, I found someone to make the production of my clothing. Um, I'm still trying to work the kinks of the social media and all, all the above. And still finishing up some final touches on the garments. But it's all, I'm doing it all by myself. And I keep giving myself excuses. I keep saying time. I'm working too much time. But what do I do when I come home? Oh, I need time for myself. Oh, so I'll sit down and be on the phone with the TV. But something I have learned is when you're dealing with something new out of your comfort zone, it's... It's not that you don't want to work on it, but it's you're coming outside your comfort zone. So it's no one wants to go outside the comfort zone. So it's harder to push yourself. But at the end of the day, you have to. Or in my case, I'll take a big old gap of doing a little bit of nothing. But let me correct myself. I'll do something different regarding the business. If I'm stuck here. I'm not going to do this anymore because it's new and I'm uncomfortable. So I'm going to go completely here. When I'm here, I feel like I'm doing nothing or nothing at all because I'm not here anymore. But in a weird way, everything is still coming together because whenever I got stuck with my garments, I went and made my company legal. So and then whenever I got when I had to do the whole waiting period over here, I felt like nothing was going on over here and nothing was going on over here. But the good thing is, I've already had my stuff worked out where I have the designs and everything. And then over here, I already did the process of writing. I'm just waiting for the paperwork to come in. Things are moving, but it feels like you're standing still. So, at least for now, for today, we'll just leave it as, at least the question, I'm going to leave it as is, what can someone tell you for you or give you for you to give up on your dream
that said I'm okay with failure now and let's fail or let's be successful.